Hi, my name is Bill LaCassie and I'm owner of Appalachian Spirit Folk Instruments. I've been making zithers, which originated in Switzerland and eventually came over to this country during the European expansion. Uh, was brought into the Appalachian Mountain area, which starts in Maine of this country and flows through here in South Carolina down into Georgia. How I got started making zithers begins with my wanting to learn to play the violin or the fiddle. I took up the instrument and started studying with a, a local fiddler. And from there I wanted to begin learning how to build the instrument. It became an interest of mine. And I began studying with a friend, another friend that I met, on uh, the subjects of violin repair and restoration. And I wanted to learn how to build instruments. Around that time, I, I, a friend of mine named Debbie Center in Littleton, Colorado, approached me with the idea of making these uh, zithers or lap harps. She had a company called World of Harmony Music, where she developed a, a book that fits inside the zither to be played. And uh, all the notes are lined up in a way that a, a child or anyone can pluck at the strings and follow the notes and play Bach, Mozart, Beethoven, or Mary Had a Little Lamb. So she had uh, a lot of her customers that buy her books, they naturally ask, where do I get a zither? And she had problems finding someone reliable that would build a good instrument, good quality and be dependable for her. So she asked me how I would feel about making it, and I saw it as a good opportunity, and I, I tried, uh, figured out how to make one, how they were built, and uh, just started from there. Each zither is individually handcrafted by me. No two are exactly alike. Where other makers might use plywoods and cheaper, softer frame woods, I use good quality tonal woods poplar being my favorite. A lot of luthiers make guitars and mountain dulcimers using poplars. Very good tone wood. It has beautiful grain to it. Takes stain very well. After deciding the angles for the frames, uh, for the sound board on the front and the back board, uh, that's all from solid wood that I plane here on site myself uh, instead of purchasing elsewhere. That keeps the cost down to the consumer. The bridges are hand carved by me, where I use typically cherry, maple, and walnut for the, for the bridges. Mapping out where the hitch pins and tuning pins goes is a very exact process, and I have to map out a grid uh, with precise measurements. So that way it'll fit the musical book that's going underneath there, where the notes will line up with the, with the music wire itself, the strings. And then from there, I string the instrument up with a, with a musical wire, like piano wire. The, the potential for this instrument is, is awesome, really. I, you can buy them as gifts for your, your children to learn how to read music before even playing the piano. I mean, it's, it's a, a far less expensive investment than many other instruments are. Um, or uh, adults may want it for their for their own enjoyment. Being able to play music, someone who's never played an instrument before, they instantly play the minute they slide the book in and start plucking. The instrument and the book also have a, a therapeutic implication to it as well. For children's homes with uh, young kids that have de developmental issues, to, uh, nursing homes, people at home with debilitating illnesses that have taken away their motor function. The instrument is just so easy to play. You don't have to be able to read music, though it'll teach you to read music if you want it to. For instance, uh, an adult customer who played a piano all of their life uh, and played well, all of a sudden they find themselves saddled with a debilitating illness and loss of motor function. This instrument uh, could turn the tide for them as well and be able to give them an avenue of musical expression, the ability to play music. I have pianists who played Bach and played Beethoven all their life. 
can play Bach and Beethoven again. It won't be a piano, but it'll be the zither. And uh, that joy that they had in music can be in their life once again. Mm -hmm.